Hi guys, Trailhound here. I don't know if you can see everything that I've got going on here. I'm trying to get the room dark for daytime. Let me just plug that in to show you this quick. What I have here is a knockoff uh, choke hazard. This piece sleeves over top of that one and the tube can be relatively stuffed uh, inside the tube. And uh, I would imagine that the same principle that I'm about to demonstrate is is going to hold true to a standard choke hazard. I've had this running for a little while and I don't know if you can tell or not. Let me try to get a little more accurate here. Um, on this ruler the very tip of the flame reaches just about three inches and what I have made here is just a small adapter that will fit right on top of the uh, this choke hazard knockoff and you've probably seen something very similar to this in a stove design um, this just being an adapter for this particular stove try to get a higher output um, let me just snuff that out quick and put this adapter on here light it back up again okay now it does take a few seconds for that to get up to temperature the outer piece but it seems like once that outer piece gets up to temperature the flame that gets put off is greatly increased you can see there we went from a three inch flame to well the very tip is it's up around five inches so the output that we've gained is significant um, from this stove. So let's just take a closer look at the burn. Of course you can see what's happening is it's getting additional oxygen um, as it's burning. So it's, it's mixing the oxygen with the fuel better and therefore we're getting a, a higher rate of burn. So this was just some uh, a way to show that you can you can take a choke hazard and you can kind of turn it up a notch uh, with just a simple adapter like that. And uh, anyway, guys, that's it for now. I'll catch you on the next round and uh, take it easy till then. Okay, so I just wanted to show this is I take the the pieces I have here, put them together. And I still have a piece left over down here. And I just wanted to show for storage purposes for that adapter. It can be stored right on there. Like that. So just uh, something you can make yourself real quick. Doesn't require any crazy machines. Um, there you go.